I'm Ivan the Inspector, and today we're going to be inspecting a thankful turkey. Won't you come along and learn with me? That's great, let's go. Do you know what kind of animal this is? That's right, it's a turkey! <gasps> with a little hat. Do you know what sound a turkey makes? That's right. <laughs> they make such funny noises, don't they? Well, turkeys are these, these big birds, and look at this, they've got these kind of feathers around the back. And guess what? We're gonna do a craft today that looks like a turkey, and it's called Thankful Turkey. You can do this along with your parents or guardians at home. It's gonna be so much fun. All right, so we've got a bunch of different things here. Let's, let's see what we've got. We've got some glue, right? We've got some tape as well that'll help us put things together. What else do we have here? We've got a Sharpie. All right, we can draw with that. We've got a pencil. Oh, do you know what these are called? That's right, they're scissors. Make sure you be very careful with them because they're sharp. And look at this, we've got a bunch of different colors of paper. What colors do we have here? Look at this, we've got black, yellow, red, orange, and white. Great job, so many different colors. All right, so putting together our thankful turkey here, I've already got this cut out. This is gonna be the turkey's body. All right, so we've got that all done. And now we've got, oh, look at these. We've got, what do you think those are gonna be? Probably eyeballs, right? So we've got eyeballs. We've got oh, the feet, right? We got them drawn on there. We've got the beak, you see that? And then we've got, this red thing. If you've ever seen a turkey, they've kind of kind of got a red thing coming off their neck. It's called a waddle. It's how they make that noise. So much fun. Okay, so we're just gonna put these on the turkey. There we go. Look at that. Doesn't that look like a turkey? No, it doesn't look like a turkey at all. I have an idea. What if we cut all of these out first? That seems like a great idea. All right, we're gonna start with a waddle. Remember, be very careful with scissors. Right, we're gonna cut just like this along the lines. See, that's why we drew the lines on first, so that we can make sure that it is the right shape. Because that would just be a bummer if it looked totally different, right? Okay, here we go. Cut that like that. There we go, almost there. Almost there, there we go. Look at that, we've got the waddle. All right, next up, we've got the yellow beak. All right, let's see if we can cut this one a little faster. This is straight lines, that makes it much easier. There we go, there we go, being careful. And dump. there we go, we've got the beak. All right, put the scraps over there. All right, next up we've got the eyeballs. Here we go, here we go. Cut around in a circle. Oh, it's hard to make it look perfectly round. But that's okay, we'll be able to tell what they are. Here we go, here we go. All right, got one eyeball. Gotta have a second one. We can't have a one-eyed turkey, can we? Oh, no, no, no. All right, cut this out all the way around. Circle, 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 circle. And one more cut, zoop, there we go. We've got two eyeballs. All right, next up we've got the turkey feet. All right, this is gonna be a little more difficult to cut because we've got a bunch of turns. The key to something like this is going nice and slow. Make sure you concentrate. You gotta focus on what you're doing. Make sure you're not like talking or narrating what you're doing because that'll distract you. So just little by little, there we go. Feeling good, I'm feeling good. Gotta be careful, you gotta make sure he has three toes. Don't wanna accidentally cut one of them off, do we? All right, here we go. And zoop. Okay, one more cut, one more cut. Oh, look at that! We've got a turkey feet. All right, we gotta get him a second one though. So here we go. All 
right, we're going in with more experience this time. I already practiced on one of them. Here we go. Whoop. Okay, and then gotta go back up and then back down. Here we go, we're getting so close. Da, 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 da. Focus, focus. Last cut. Zoop, doop, doop, doop. And boom. <gasps> Look at that. We got a turkey leg. Oh, that looks great. Okay. We are now going to put these onto the turkey. All right. So let's start off with, hmm, let's try some glue, right? This is the sticky stuff. I'll stick the paper together. So we're going to take the glue and we're going to put a little bit, whoop, oh, little bit onto the foot. You see that? Whoa. Jumped around, jumped around. Here we go. And we're going to push it down onto the bottom. Look at that. That looks like a turkey leg. All right. Here we go. We'll do the same thing to this one. A little bit of glue. Careful, it's sticky. Here we go. And we'll put that on just like that. There we go. Look at that. Got a couple turkey legs on there. All right, this is my favorite part. This is gonna look really cool. All right, we're gonna take the red part. Do you remember what this is called? It's the waddle. Yeah, that's a funny sounding word. And oh, got a little too much glue. It's okay, we can recover. We can recover. All right, we're gonna put this right in the middle. Put it down just like that. Okay, got the waddle in the middle. Next up, we've got the beak. All right, we'll put a little bit of glue. Little bit of glue, here we go, all right. And we'll take that, put it down like that. Look at that, we've got the beak right over the waddle. Looking good, all right, next up we've got the eyeballs, right? The turkey's gotta be able to see where it's going. So let's get a little glue on just like that and then let's put it down right above the beak. There we go, we got one, one in there. Next one, there we go. I'm gonna wipe a little glue from my finger on there. Here we go. Get a little more glue. All right, and we'll put that down just like that. Well, the turkey looks kind of funny, doesn't it? I think we're missing something. Oh, I know. Let's draw in the eyeballs for him. Here we go, put it right there. And right there. Wow, look at that. It's starting to look like a turkey. Isn't that awesome? Way to go. Well, hey, I have an idea. Why don't you stand up with me and let's take a turkey dance break. Come on, let's go. so much better after that dance break, don't you? Thank you so much for dancing with me. All right, now we're getting to the really cool part here. Do you remember I called this a thankful turkey? Have you ever heard that word before, thankful? Well, being thankful for something is, is being really happy that you have it in your life. It's maybe something you'd be sad if you didn't have. So what are some things that you really like? What are some things that make you really happy? Start thinking about that, because we're gonna use them in a second. Okay. So we've got our turkey, but we're missing all the feathers, right? So what we are gonna do, <laughs> we're gonna cut out some feathers. You see we have some feathers drawn out here? So we're gonna cut them out and look, we've got a couple of different colors behind it. So we're gonna get a bunch of feathers, right? Okay, so let's grab our scissors and we're gonna start cutting these. There we go. So it is November right now. That's a, a month of the year. And at the end of November, we have one of my favorite holidays, and it's called Thanksgiving. It's a holiday that's all about being thankful for what you have. So your family might get together and eat a bunch of food, maybe watch some football. There's all kinds of really fun Thanksgiving traditions. I think my favorite part about it is the food. My family eats all kinds of delicious food every year. It's so much fun. Here we go. So as we're doing this, the best thing you can do is 
Think about the things that you're thankful for. Think about the things that make you happy. Because did you know if you're really thankful for stuff, you'll actually be a happier person. All right, here we go. We're gonna cut that out. We're halfway there, doing great. All right, here we go. Get that all centered up. Here we go. Just like the little things, I'm going slow, making sure we stay on the line. Just like that, here we go. And cut like that. Right along the line, you see? All right, and then the last one over there. Okay, good. Whoa, look at, look at all of the colors. Okay, let's see if we can get this all together. We're almost there. Oh, hold on, I lost a color. Let's get this lined up. There we go. All right, here we go. Cut, 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 cut. Cut, 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 cut. Right along the line. All right. So the idea of thankful turkey is you start at the beginning of November, you make your turkey, which we just did, and then you're supposed to take a feather every single day, and you're supposed to think of something that you're thankful for. So let me see, what's something I'm thankful for? I'm really thankful for food. I love food, do you love food? Yeah, food is the best. What's your favorite kind of food? Hmm, let's see. I think pizza is my favorite kind of food. I'm gonna write pizza. Pizza! So thankful for pizza. All right, so we came up with something that we're thankful for, and then we're gonna take the glue here, and then we're gonna put it down on our kind of background here. There we go, thankful for pizza. Look at that, and then eventually this is gonna go right here, but we gotta fill in some more things, okay? All right, let's come up with another one. Let's see. Here's an orange one. All right, something else I'm thankful for. Hmm, I'm really thankful for my family. I've got a really great family. I'm thankful for family. Okay, I can put this down like this, a little more glue. All right, we're gonna put our family feather just like that. There we go, so we got pizza. And we got family. Okay, let's keep going here. What's something else I'm thankful for? Hmm, I'm trying to think of all the things that we've done. Oh, I'm thankful for snow. Snow, it's so much fun. It's white, it's beautiful. It's fun to play in. I'm very thankful for snow. All right, here we go. We'll put on some more. There we go. Do, do, do. Here we go, we'll put that down like that. There we go, awesome. Okay, let's see, what's something else I'm thankful for? Hmm, hey, I'm thankful for you. I'm so thankful that you're watching these videos. I'm gonna write Y-O-U. Very thankful for you, thanks for watching. All right, let's put this down like this. There we go. Do, do, do. All right, so let's do one more together, here we go. What's something else I'm thankful for? Hmm. How about my friends? Do you have friends that you're thankful for? That's awesome, here we go. Friends, there we go. Let's get some glue right here. And we'll put this down just like that. All right, we've got five things we're thankful for. Let's see if we can add our turkey to it. You ready? Here we go, we gotta get a bunch of glue. Yep, 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 there we go. All right, I'm gonna put it down just like that. I'm gonna press down. All right, we're gonna push down and count to five. You ready? One, two, three, four, five. There we go, look at that. We've got our thankful turkey. I'm thankful for snow and viewers like you, friends, and pizza, and my family. Isn't that great? Well, hey, you should put together a thankful turkey with your family too. It's such a fun activity and it gives us a chance to be thankful. Well, thank you so much for coming along and learning about Thankful Turkey with me. If you'd like to check out more of my episodes, type in Ivy the Inspector. Bye. Ivy.